All right, shalom, shalom to the elect of the nation of Israel. First and foremost, call halal wa kabad al Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. All praise and glory unto the heavenly Father, whose true and proper name is Yahweh, in the name of the Lord and Savior of the nation of Israel, whose true and proper name is Yahweh Shai by Hashem Rakhakwadash, in the name of the Holy Spirit. Double honors to my apostles and my elders and great millstone who lead, teach, and rule well. Love, honors to my fellow Akin, pushing the word, and true favor, sincerity across the four corners. And shout out to the sincere listeners who listen and subscribe to the men in Doctrine of Great Millstone. It's the brother Yadav from Jima Atlanta Church, uh, coming with another spiritual in transit. And I'm going to title it, uh, In the Spirit, Time is Moving Fast. Um, man, it's, uh, today is February 1st, uh, 2019. The year of Karagma, and it seems like yesterday that we were entering into um, into 2019, and here it is. The entire month of January is already gone, man. You know, January, you know, is uh, is out of here, man. So, you know, just <laughs> seeing all the things that have transpired um, in the last month, you know the the government shutdown, uh, which is temp uh, temporarily halted, you know, for this three week period, um, you know, just seeing how fast everything is moving, even even time itself, even time itself is moving fast, you know, and in the spirit, I wanted to get into this lesson because that's prophecy. It's prophecy that time in these last days would speed up. So um I am driving, but that is in uh Matthew twenty fourth chapter, Matthew twenty four and verse uh verse twenty. For pray that your flight be not in the winter nor on the Sabbath day, for then shall be great tribulation, such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time, no, nor ever shall be. So, um, you know, how was I going into praying that this, uh, this tribulation doesn't come in the winter on the Sabbath day, going into understanding the time, you know, understanding the time of things, you know, and, um, shoot, just hoping and praying that we're not caught off guard, man. You know, but uh, the scriptures say, um, for then shall be great tribulation, such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time, no, nor ever shall be. Verse 22, and except those days should be shortened, there should no flesh be saved, but for the elect's sake, those days shall be shortened. All right, because. Man, we, we don't, we, you know, we have an insight, but we don't fully understand the magnitude of, and the, the treachery of, um, these devils' plans, man. You know, these devils going into, um, Esau Edom, the nation of, uh, of, uh, Esau Edom, the nation of, uh, of Edom, the so-called white man. And, well, really, let me say this, the elites of Esau Edom, you know, we, we, we we have glimpses as to uh the extent that these that these devils will go to to implement their so called new world order agenda and their new world order system. But at the same time it's like, man, when 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 Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah puts a spirit on these devils to 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 hit that hit that button, that go button so to speak, um, you know, to to try to try to complete his uh his authority and control of of uh of this world you know it's gonna get ugly out here man you know what i'm saying to the point that the scriptures say that if those times weren't shortened that there would be no flesh would be saved would be saved you know but that's the beauty that's the beauty of this of this word man and this and these uh this this covenant and this promise that we were we we be, we the Israelites all right 
want to get consistent so called Negro Latino Native Americans and confusion to face abroad. That's that's the beauty of of this covenant and of the words given to us through the by the inspiration, all right, that the most high put on men to um to have access to this covenant, man. Okay? Because even even with the oncoming doom, gloom, and destruction, all right, uh, ending, ending ultimately in America being destroyed by millions of uh, ICBM thermonuclear missiles and warheads, in the midst of all that calamity and death and pain and destruction, the remnant, the elect of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, a promise to be saved, man, all right? A promise are, are, are given access to a promise. Well, I'm going to say this. The, the elect, like the scriptures say, the elect will be saved. All right. But for us, the hopeful elect, you know, with with, with the how about how was shy, shortening the, the time and the days. OK. Salvation is, is near, man. You know, salvation is near. You know, like I said. Here it is. It's already uh, uh, February, February 2019, the year of Karagma. And I'm just like, damn, man, what happened in January? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I'm going to say this, too. You know, in the world, I was never one of, them, one of those people who, you know, kind of like felt that. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 it wasn't too often that I felt that that way and being like, man, that, you know, this time flew by, you know. I know, I know, you know, coming up, they say as you get older, you kind of feel that way. But it makes sense now. It makes sense as to why the time is speeding up now because salvation is that salvation is near. You know, salvation is is near. All right, and then and and once again, I'm gonna say the the time speeding up is is biblical prophecy, man. Okay, and I don't want to. Uh, you know, beat that point at nausea. I did want to get this other uh, this other precept. This is Romans in uh, thirteen, verse eleven. Romans thirteen and eleven, and that knowing the time, that now it is high time to awake out of sleep. Okay, because you know we. We were all asleep, man. All right. The most side, the most side stripping us, stripping us of our heritage, our culture, our, our, um, our, uh, understanding, you know, and not, um, opening the, the seals of the, of the Holy, of the Holy Bible for us to, for us to understand, you know, as a nation, as a nation and, um, and also individually, you know, that put us in a, 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 a spiritual state of slumber, you know, but this goes hand in hand. This goes hand in hand. With uh, the seals being the seals being loosened, okay, time speeding up, um, the the true uh, nature and evil of Esau Eden being shown, all right, across uh, across the country, across America, and also around the world, all right. The simplicity of Jake, okay, and Jake wanted to to bask in uh, spiritual filth. But then also, I'll say this too. Also, the 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 righteousness, you know, uh, coming into effect. Okay, what well, you know, starting with the the men, the the hopeful, well, the hopeful elect. But then also the men of the Lord. All right, the men of the Lord are being raised up in in uh, in this time and in this day, you know. And Lord willing, I'm one of those men, and Lord willing, I'm amongst those men, which I believe wholeheartedly that, I, that I'm amongst men of the Lord, you know. And of course, time will tell. But this is all fulfillment of prophecy, man. Okay, all right. And and this and this is the high time um, for us to wake out of sleep. Okay. Um, for for now is our salvation nearer than when we believed, because man, this thing is moving fast. Okay, <laughs> okay. You know, me myself personally being in the camp coming up on two years, you know, I'm going to speak specifically with my first year, my first year, I'm, you know, I see, uh, older men, you know, uh, 
old elder men in the spirit, they say make statements like, man, this thing moving fast, man. I ain't never seen it. I ain't never seen, you know, the spirit moving so fast. I ain't never seen this moving so fast. And yeah, of course, you know, especially with you being a younger man, you're like, yeah, I'm you trying to you trying to keep up, you know. So sometimes, I mean, of course, you know, there's there's times when I'm gonna speak for myself. There were times where I felt overwhelmed in the spirit because it's like, where do you begin? You know, but and I'm not saying that I'm on any type of, you know, I'm not I'm I haven't been here truth, you know, 20, 30 years. I, I'm not saying that. I'm just saying as far as my perspective and my time, you know, being in the camp. It's like, man, you see things and you see how fast things happen and things be happening back to back to back to back. You're like, man. And then you see other men grow in the spirit. You know, you, you know, Lord willing, uh, how about me? How a shot substance dwells with you. So you kind of see certain things, your spiritual growth. And, you know, even even being able to um, uh, take care of your, your spiritual responsibilities. OK, and, 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 and balance that with things that you have to balance in the world. All right. And and, you know, walking the straight gate, you know, you, you have through experience. Experience is the best teacher. You know, so through experience, you know, you get we, we get quick and through experience as well, you know, but see, that goes hand in hand with um, awaking out of sleep because this is the time man, salvation is nearer than we, than we believe. All right. To the to the brothers and sisters out there, man, salvation is nearer than we than we believe. That's why there's so many things popping off. All right. That's 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 why. Um, the, 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 there's these issues with Venezuela, all right, because uh, Venezuela has an abundance of oil, and of course the the American uh, government is trying to do their part to get in there and and um, and uh, uh, gain access to and control those resources, just the same thing that they did in the Middle East. The same the same thing that these that these Edomites have done all around the world, man. All right. They want to get in, control the land, control the resources, control the people, all right, and then uh, eventually spread their spiritual wickedness, man. Plant wicked uh, spiritual seeds, okay. But the but the beautiful thing about uh, about about Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai's program, and the beautiful thing about this time, is that once again, the the elect are being risen up. Started with the men of our nation, all right, the women of our nation. Uh, are beginning to and will be, and will continue to fall in order, okay? And 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 through and through the obedience of um, of the men and women, of course, uh, there's going to be uh, children and households not only saved but also healed, man. All right, just like in the time of Acts, when um, the disciples were going about and and and, and people were bringing uh, others to 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 the disciples to be healed, okay? Not only not only in the physical sense, but also in the spiritual sense, man. All right, because once again, our, our we our people, nation of Israel, we were sick, man. We were um, uh, destitute. Okay, we had we had no access to our powers, man. You have a body, you have a shot. Okay, but now but now is the hot time to awake out of sleep, man. Okay, because like the scriptures say, our salvation is nearer than we, than we nearer uh, nearer than what we believed. Okay. And 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 we also can um, can trust in the fact that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is cutting this time shorter and shorter and speeding and speeding things up so that we can um, you know we can get the hell up out of here, man. <laughs> you know, and I don't want to uh, you know ramble at the mouth, but I'm gonna end it there. I hope to pray this lesson was edifying. Once again, call Halal Wakabad Al Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All praise and glory to the Heavenly Father Yahweh. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, Hashem, Rakakwadash, in the name of the Holy Spirit. Double honors to my apostles and my elders of Great Millstone who lead, teach, and rule well. Love and honors to my fellow occupation of the word and faith, truth, and sincerity. Shalom to you, sincere listeners. Once again, Lord willing, you edify until next time. Shalom.